You're watching the Financial News Network. I'm Chuck Pierce, and here's what's in the news for Tuesday, November 15th. The Wall Street Journal reports that hundreds of millions of dollars might have gone missing from customer accounts at MF Global Holdings four days before it filed for bankruptcy protection. The Journal also reports that Bank of New York Mellon CEO Gerald Hassel said the company is willing to negotiate reasonable settlements of lawsuits that accuse it of improperly charging clients in currency trades. Bloomberg reports that Dallas Fed Bank President Richard Fisher said he sees lowering odds that the central bank will need to ease policy further amid signs that the U.S. economy is poised for growth. Finally, Reuters reports that Qatar Airways ended an expected $6.5 billion deal with Airbus and signed a deal with Boeing. For more updates on these stories and more, keep it right here to the Financial News Network. I'm Chuck Pierce.